Hello everybody and welcome back. Today we're, we're doing some more Arc Valguero. We're doing episode 2 of the playthrough. And we've got some pretty uh, lofty goals for today. Ex excuse me, sir. <laughs> I guess he just doesn't care about the... Oh, oh no, no. <laughs> Wait, why is this happening already? <laughs> uh, we're gonna have to abandon base for a little bit. <laughs> anyway, our goals for today's video are... We're, we're gonna actually go for a tame on one of these Rexes. I know we, we barely have any materials. We're still, <laughs> we're still using uh, primitive stone tools. So... I did some calculations on dodo decks, and it turns out that I will need about 66 arrows minimum requirement to knock out the 95 rex. So I'm going to try to do that today, but in order to do that we're probably going to need something that's going to keep us alive, and, and these things I don't think can outrun rexes, the parasaur is a little too slow. So preferably I tame up something like an Iguanodon with infinite stamina or something that can at least move quickly that I can shoot from the back of, and we can knock out the Rex. I mean, I could just do it the old fashioned way as well and just literally run around, but it's, uh, it's a little dangerous. I mean, I know we can't, we also can't saddle a Rex until like, what, like level 80, 80 something? 74. So <laughs> we're a ways off, but I wanted to do it just for fun anyway. Clean up the beach area, it'll make our base a lot safer. I mean, not much is gonna mess with the Rex. We get our our neighbor neighborhood rexes are uh, coming together. We're kind of in a bad spot here. <laughs> oh wait, blue supply drop. When can we open these? Why do I hear? How are they always on top of me? What the hell? I <laughs> check a supply drop for two seconds. <laughs> here, move. Come on, parasaur. Um, we might be in trouble, guys. <laughs> Come on, Parasaur. You got it. Come on. <laughs> We're encumbered because of the berries, too. Oh, no. <laughs> He's gaining. <laughs> Wait. Okay. Destro oh, my <laughs> gosh. The other one. Okay. <laughs> We're going to go over here. Behind this rock. We, we need to dump these berries real fast. All right, the Rexes seem to have disappeared for now, and we got ourselves a sickle, finally. Apparently that's not real grass. Anyway, we got, some, we got an easy source of fiber now. This is what we were missing. So we'll be able to get on making arrows really rapidly. Oh my goodness. What? No way. One of our Rex buddies was, this is the 95, no. I feel like he actually had pretty good stats for a 95, damn. Alright, well, <laughs> 95 is down, I'll have to see, I mean, that Bronto is probably the culprit right there. Alright, we have our first small enemies, look at that. <laughs> first small enemies of the playthrough, there's a couple of raptors down there, I think that's what the other one is. I know there's one right here. Yeah, they're pissed at me. Honestly, it wouldn't be like a terrible thing to do the tame from it, they just have terrible carry weight, and stamina is like kind of average, I think, too. Oh, they're pissed. Uh-oh. No! 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 Use my health, I must use it as a sacrifice. No! Parasnuffler! Not Parasnuffler! No! No! You will pay! You would pay with your life. Level 60 Raptor. You will now work for me. This can't be that many arrows, right? Okay. We got one. You're number two. You will work for me now. You take my Parasaur from me. How dare you. My one regular arrow. <laughs> I'm actually kind of sad that that happened. <laughs> No. Where did they kill him, too? It's in this. I can't... Where's his bag? It's in this mess of a thicket. I'm gonna have to clear the whole thing. Uh-oh. Hear the Rex. Stay away. Oh, no. Come on. Come on, buddy. Get over here. You need to be on passive so we can get out. 
I will name them both in a second. We just gotta... I need 20 wood. Oh boy. Alright, this one's an 89. Alright, 173 carry weight. That's just terrible. They're both eating my meat right now because I don't have any other raw. Alright, let's... <laughs> Bring him back. This is this is not not according to plan right now. When does it ever go according to plan though? There's the Rex. Oh no. Um, bad time to craft a saddle. How long is this? Oh my gosh. <laughs> How is their stamina? Oh, their stamina is actually pretty good. So carry away to the major issue here. So I could go for a Rex knock right now. Preferably we find a good one then if we're just gonna go through the effort, right? I don't know. All right. Rubbler and Robbler have joined the tribe of Grub Snobbler. Fuck, what's my name? <laughs> Grub Sniffler. <laughs> All right. Rubbler and Robbler have joined the tribe of Grub Snuffler. It is official. Oh no. Bad news. Time to go. Where's our other raptor? Jeez, man. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Alright, so we got our metal in now. We're gonna, we're gonna smelt that up. So I just went and looked it up. We're gonna need, if we actually do want to try to find a 150, we're gonna need 100... No, we're gonna need 98 trank arrows. Minimum. So we're gonna need over 100 arrows if we actually try to do that. So, that's gonna be a lot. I mean, we could do it, we got 158. It's just gonna be, it's gonna be a process, so. <laughs> and, and we're not in a good position right now. I mean, like, we've got very, very little stuff, you know? <laughs> Primitive hide, a couple of raptors here, one storage raptor at just peaking 400 health. This one's at 700, so. Not the best thing in the world. We do have two sleeping bags that I got from a supply drop though, so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take one of these. We'll bring one of these with us, so we can put down like a manual quick respawn point without any hassle. I also really wanna craft a spyglass because that's gonna really help identify levels without dying. All right, I'm gonna go look around for some crystal. I think we found another Rex. <laughs> oh, that one looks cool. Level 90. All right, we took one hit, level 90. Wait, no way, this is perfect. Wait, there's a metal rock here as well? Oh, this is great. And a tiny deposit of quartz. This is exactly where we wanted to spawn, look at this. Can I break it with this? Uh-oh. We need metal! All right, metal tools acquired. We can just go ahead and dump these. Drop in the metal ones. I don't know why I didn't do that earlier, <laughs> but we're doing it now. Okay, now this should work. There we go. Spyglass, finally. All right, now we need to go on a Rex hunt. Oh, it's a Spino, that's a sick color scheme. 50. Damn. Spinos are real good. Like they can, they can haul on the edge of the water. I don't, I feel like there's not very many Spino spawns in this map though, that's a really nice looking one. I just really don't want to take a level 50 Spino because their stats are just terrible when they're low. We got one. What is it? I can't see anything. Wait. 20. <laughs> okay, well, we're not off to a good start. Before we go down to the valley, I'm going to take a peek up here. Oh my, I actually got jump scared by this guy. <laughs> what are you doing in here? Scorpions and dogs, uh oh. Trouble on the plateau. Dude, oh no. Robbler, what? Well, why didn't you move? Are they still on me? Oh my. Um, Robbler, sorry, we can't really go back for your stuff. Alright, we're down. <laughs> We're down one. Ooh, that's an Allosaurus. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, seriously? Ugh. 
Oh, go. Dang, I really want to see the level on this Allosaurus. Alright, this is a this is not where we want to be. This is a bad spot. <laughs> ah, thank you, Triceratops. And for those of you who don't know, the reason you see me jumping off my mount right before I hit the ground is so I don't take a huge amount of fall damage. Because if you're riding your mount, you will take fall damage, your dinosaur will take fall damage. But if you if you jump off or if nobody's riding them when they hit the ground, they take zero fall damage. So I'm kinda oh no. They go so fast. Yeah, that's a 140. We're not gonna we're not gonna hang out here. What is yeah, there's another Allosaurus fight going on. This is scary. this is a terrible area. Why did they come here? <laughs> 95, okay. Oh, we got another Rex. 25, dude, they're all terrible. <laughs> I don't know, a little 90 Rex back at base is starting to look pretty, pretty tempting. Oh, oh, please be good. It's so cool looking. Yes! 140, that's our Rex. I don't care, it's, it's close enough to max, right? I think there's one more over there. I'm just gonna scan it real quick. Oh yeah, that's a, that's the fifth. That's a fifteen in there. This is a one forty right here, chasing an Equus in the water. <laughs> that is a huge saber tooth salmon. Oh my! Wait, it's enormous. Wow, it's as big as my raptor is. <laughs> one forty Rex. We can't miss the arrows. We're in for the long haul. I don't even know if this crossbow is gonna be able to keep up with the amount of arrows this Rex is gonna need. I, it might break. What is pissed at me? Piranha still? Oh no. Not one of these. I hate these things. Uh. Hold on. Uh oh. Dude, no way. Oh, I pinned him! Yes! Good job! Uh oh. Get him! Beat him up! Oh my gosh, I hate micro raptors. I'm really glad we got that out of the way, like I was saying right now, <laughs> instead, <laughs> instead of, because it would have happened, I guarantee you it would have happened exactly while I was trying to do that tame. What does it take to make a bow? A bow, 15 wood. I'm gonna have a backup bow just in case, I think. It's probably a smart idea here. All right, where did that Rex go? Oh, there's another one? <gasps> Wait. Oh my god, no way! That's a female! It's like a- it's a pair! They have almost identical color schemes too. Alright, this is kind of annoying because these Brontos are gonna deal a huge amount of damage. And also, we don't want to get confused about which Rex we're trying to knock here. So there's a female fighting a 95. That female is gonna be in, uh, hurting a little bit. Alright, let's start the knock. We have a hundred and... Damn it, he engaged with the Brontos. This is exactly what I didn't want to have happen. 50 and 90. I can't really help either. At least it's not a mating pair. I can help with my bow. <laughs> Shooting regular arrows. Oh, I was gonna get the... the this is not good. Alright, what level? 95, 145. Yeah, you're in trouble. Alright, let's see if the other one killed itself. Nope. No, it did not. What's it fighting? Is that a micro? Alright, it killed it. Alright, we're gonna go for this one. Number one. Number two. Number three. Oh, number four. No, not the time to take a shit, come on. Number five. Number six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ow. Eleven. Don't fight the stake. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. I think I missed one, so that's fourteen, right? Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty. Oh, this is... We're not gonna have enough durability. 21. 22. 23. 
trying to get my raptors and stamina regen whenever I can't. Oh no, that's a micro raptor. Fuck, 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 fuck. Get him. Oh, we're so forced to the rap. Okay. Oh, the Rex is over there. It re aggroed. Wow, that was lucky. What was my count? Is that 28? 29. 30. 31. 32. 33. He's on to us. 34. 35. Wow, right through the bushes. 36. 37. 38. 39. It's coming right over that rock. 40. I probably shot like 45 arrows. Oh, we would have disturbed, but it's really close. 41, I think. 42. 43. 44. 45. 46. 47. 48. 49. Use the trees. 50. 51. 52, 53, 54, 55, oh, 56, I thought I had more cover there, 57, oh, hi, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, this is good. 60, 69, eat the Equus. 70, 71, he's slow in the water. 72, 73, 74, is he running? He's running. 75, 76, 77, 78, keep him away from the water. 9, away from the water Rex, 80, 81, away from the water, 2, 83, 84, crossbow's gonna break, 85, I hope this bow can do it, now it does a lot less, 86, 87, 8, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100 arrows, 101, 102, 103, stay away from the water, yes, 104, 105, I don't know how I'm going to need now, 106, he's out, oh boy, well, let's go. Um, I wasted an arrow because I'm panicking. Stop. Oh my gosh. We knocked him. Now we need to make sure that the area is clear. We got to go get some prime, like, instantly right now. Oh boy, what kind of prime meat can I acquire on the back of a raptor? All right, we have... Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. This shit. Fucking micro raptors, man. They always try to mess up your day. Where did he go? He's, he's, what he's gonna do is he's gonna attack me. Yep. Okay. Beat him up. Beat him up. There we go. See, that's that's what he would have done while I was trying to 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 go over and help out my team. So glad we got that out of the way now again. Like I was saying. I always hate this, because if you leave line of sight of your tame, like if you go super far from it, not line of sight, but just far enough away, the spawns will reset. So I'm gonna like spawn into some Bronto fighting another Rex and they're all like splash damaging him with the tail. No, don't eat him, don't eat him, don't eat him. Let me get a bite, come on. 
Yes. Oh, look how much crap spawned in here. So I literally have literally zero idea now about what could be hanging out here. Oh, 49%? He was very hungry. Why is there steam coming out of the mountain? <laughs> also, if you guys don't know how arc taming works, I guess you probably should have gone over this before. I'm assuming most of you do who are watching this series. <laughs> but you have a progress a progress bar and an effectiveness bar. So taming effectiveness 99.9%. Uh, each time they eat, they will lose a tiny, tiny portion of that percentage, taming effectiveness uh, percentage bar. And the you want the percentage bar to be high, because the higher it is, the more bonus levels you get when you tame it. You get bonus levels. And so, if it gets damaged during the taming time, when it's unconscious, you will lose a chunk of percent. So if I went over and attacked that once, it would probably drop to like a 70-ish percent, and then down to like a 50, and then maybe like a, you know, 20, and then it would be at nothing. And, and also, every time they eat, the meat will be less effective for every bite. So, you know, if each prime meat is doing, like, 20% right now, if I got hit, each prime meat would probably be doing, like, 15% or 12%. It makes, the, it makes the tame slower. So, you want to avoid your effectiveness dropping at all costs, if possible. And uh, that way you'll have the most successful and efficient tame in terms of time and levels. But, you know, Ark loves to, to stick up predators around when you're taming. And then run them over, so they'll have, be having like an AI duel of uh, herbivores and predators right around your taming site. <laughs> and uh, it'll mess the taming effectiveness up. So we're going to try to avoid that. Oh, it scared me. <laughs> oh, I, got, I actually got jump scared by that. <laughs> we did it. We did it. <laughs> Level 209 Rex. Oh my gosh. Welcome to the tribe of Grub Snuffler. Snuffler Rex, there we go. One word. Ah, uh, I can't believe that it was actually... <laughs> I can't tell you guys, the amount of times that you play Ark and things just go absolutely... Just like, just terribly. Just as far as they possibly could off of what you had planned. Just, it happens so frequently and I can't believe that we actually managed to do this first try without really any major hiccups just you wouldn't believe i'm i'm pretty i'm pretty amazed so 7400 health i don't remember i haven't tamed a rex in 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 forever it's been a long time since i was playing before before the series i hadn't played arc in probably two or three months or something or more probably more than that and I, I was on Aberration, and there aren't any Rexes in Aberration, so I haven't tamed a Rex in... I don't I can't even remember how long it's been. But, so I don't remember what the stats... What, what good stats look like, is my point. But this looks pretty good to me. I don't remember... 880 carry weight, I'm pretty sure, is, like, decently high. Melee looks good. It's almost 400%. Stamina, I think, is about average, which is fine. And their stamina doesn't really drain anyway. And it's not too bad, I don't think. And the health pool, I think... I don't know if it's on the high or low side. It is a 140, but I can't remember if, if closer to 1k is what you what you uh, want for good stats. Right, I'm going to have him follow the raptor. And let's see, we'll put him on... Or her, right? This is a her. Yeah, we'll put her on neutral. Let's get that roar. Very nice. Also, it's nighttime. You can't see the cool color scheme. The color scheme... Oh, you can from this side. Thank you, moon. It's very nice. Very cool color scheme. I like the white on the feet, too. Okay. Question is, will we be able to get Snuffler Rex home safely? I think we'll probably wait till next episode to do that. Well, we were successful. I can't believe we are actually successful in our quest to tame a Rex. We, we did it. <laughs> Even with the crossbow breaking, we did it. With a prime meat to spare. We got lucky with that, too. We got to take a bite out of the dip or the, the Bronto as it was going by. We really went by it. So that was good. <laughs> well... If you guys like this episode of Arc Valguero, press that like button. If you're new to the channel and you're enjoying my content, press that subscribe button. And boy, this has been a fun series so far. I know I haven't done this in about a week, but we'll, we'll, we'll try to do it semi-frequently and keep going. I'm enjoying it. Hope you guys are too. And I will see you next time for our next video or live stream. Goodbye.